What up? Um. Yeah. Uh, one of my female friends decided to um ask me a question that I've been seeing in like almost every media that I am accustomed to, and I'm really I'm getting really tired of this question because it's really, 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 really stupid. Now I'm not trying to say stupid as in dumb. I'm just saying stupid as in y'all already know the answers to these well the answer to this question because um I just think now I'm not really trying to disrespect y'all women I'm just saying some of y'all just not using y'all brain um how come there ain't no good men left and you know yeah kinda hot hold on alright no I, I'm just saying, there probably are. Like, you know, and don't get me wrong, there's probably some men out there probably saying, how come there ain't no good women there? And again, I'm going to say, they are. It's just, y'all may not be looking at them in that kind of light. Um, and what I mean by that, I mean just, um, y'all are attractive. No, not attractive, attracted, you know, to the opposite sex of, you know what I mean, of the bad one. Y'all don't, y'all don't really look at the good one because the good one don't really stand out and he's, and that he or she is not standing out for a reason. It's because they're not trying to be the bad one. Um, you know, you are, like, when I when I see things, when I interact with things, I like to think with my brain. You know what I mean? I think logically, almost almost strategically. You know what I mean about my shit. So it's like I think about it, like to me. It, I don't want, I don't want to say it's a game. I just want to say like you have to know the rules. You have to know what you're getting into. You gotta know everything about what it is you're doing, so you don't come out. The loser, and when I and again, what I mean by that is just if you see a good woman, you see a good man, whatever, you know, you're supposed to acknowledge that person. You're not supposed to just fucking ignore them because that's why y'all asked that question. But it's like when y'all ask that question, I'd be like, yo, there probably was one or two out there that probably was trying to make you notice them, and you just. You're, bluntly refuse to fucking just do that just that you know now for those who really know me know my personality know how I am deep down I'm a nice guy so I'm speaking for the nice guys can't really speak for the nice girl because I'm not a female but for the nice nice guys out there namely me uh, you guys don't acknowledge us you guys don't, um, y'all don't see us as, oh, I like him, oh, let me, um, let me see what he's about, y'all don't, y'all don't do that with us, y'all do that to the badasses, y'all do that to the motherfuckers that just, you know, y'all know he will get you either locked up in a cell or dead in a box underneath six feet underneath with fucking dirt. That's just how it is. Now, um, reason why there ain't no good men left. Uh, because y'all just not y'all y'all just blind. Y'all blind to it. Blind as if I was wearing like diamond everything and that's just shining so brightly that you would have to wear shades just to see me. Now, that's what I mean. I mean, I could be chivalrous as fuck and be in the perfect gentleman as I am. You guys will still, still won't acknowledge me. But the guy, the bad guy, the one that just, like, he does the complete opposite of the nice guy. Y'all easily pick him up. Y'all easily just, like, 
see what he's about knowing now this this again with according to my other videos you guys know I, I, I want to believe people are not that damn stupid y'all must know that you better get into some serious drama fucking with him and the good guy namely me just trying to avoid all that drama shit you know the old saying goes, save the drama for your mama? That's pretty much what I do. Save the drama for someone else. Because I ain't, I ain't the one. You know what I mean? I try to avoid all that shit because it does not get you nowhere. It's like when you're in a relationship, when you're trying to get into a relationship, the main thing is to, is to build. You have to look at it like that. Like you're trying to um, construct a building. You know, you start with a foundation. You know, you start making boards. Next thing you know, you got a perfect fucking house. You know what I mean? If you're gonna deal with a bad guy, you might you might start off with a nice foundation, you know, but then and then you know you start putting some boards up thinking, alright, it may work. But then you know some somehow, some way there's always gonna be a problem in that house where you gotta constantly fix shit, you gotta constantly fucking um you know, maintain shit, you gotta make sure you know, the woods don't rot, the fucking foundation is sturdy as hell, so the whole building just don't collapse. And that's usually what happens. The shit just collapse. And then y'all cry. Y'all go boohoo all fucking day. And then guess who listens to all that shit? The nice guy. The nice guy has to be there. Has to fucking be in like, oh yeah, there, there. No problem. You know, it's going to be alright. You know, there's plenty of fish out there. All that all that talk. Nah. Like, I'm, I'm going to speak for them. We're tired of hearing that. Just fucking go for the nice guy and say that way. You don't have to fucking talk to us about that shit. You'll, you'll be telling us how happy you are. You'll be telling us how things are going well and shit. Y'all be, you know what I mean? Y'all be on that level instead of the opposite. And that's just what I'm saying. Um, yeah. So I hope I answered that question to the first. And I hope a lot can agree to what the fuck I'm saying because. Again, personal experience, and not only by my, my own experience, which is basically what I see in here out, out there. You know what I mean? That's just me. It's why there ain't no good people left. We are just blind to the fucking fact. Let me let me reiterate that. We are just fucking blind to the fact that that's why there's no good people out there. We are fucking eyelids are glued the fuck shut. So y'all don't see it. You know that see no e see no evil hear no evil speak no evil. Well, it's the opposite with you girls, and I shouldn't even say you girls. I should just say you people because I'm just speaking. I just said you girls because you know a girl is asking this question. So yeah, that's pretty much it. The reason ain't no good people out there is because y'all blind to that shit. Y'all want to stay blind because y'all don't want to see. But those, but I, I appreciate those that do. I appreciate those that be like, damn, I keep messing with these assholes. I keep messing with these bad people. Damn, what can I do to change that? What can I do to not fall for that bullshit circle over and over and over and over again? Hmm, maybe change the way you think. Maybe change your perspective on the opposite sex or wherever, or wherever your, your preferences are. Maybe, um, instead of you constantly doing the same thing over and over and over, maybe switch it up, maybe do an opposite thing, maybe see how that, what that road will take you. Maybe it'll take you to somewhere better, maybe it won't. I'm just saying, do something different. Maybe that's the problem. Maybe it's not just them, maybe it's you. There's always that, there's always that fucking, um, scenario. And that's it. That's all there is to it. Uh, yeah, that's it. That's it. That's all I want to say to it. That's all I want to say about the subject. Because there's nothing more to say. Nice people, they say finish last. Well, yeah. Yeah, you might as well say that because we're always last place. We're always that last resort because they don't want to see motherfuckers the, the way they are. Now, me, personally, personally, if I'm going to look for a chick and I want a good girl, not a bad one, 
obviously I'm going to be looking for some qualities within this chick that just you know differentiates her from the norm of what most people would go for and what I mean by that I mean just like you know she's a badass you know she's fucking no good you know she's just like you know you're gonna, you're gonna end up breaking up sooner or later if you already have that mentality in your head already at the start even before you even approach her then yeah chances are it's not gonna work but if you're looking for that person that's like oh shit she did something different oh most girls would have done this she did the opposite oh shit you know what I mean maybe maybe she's good and that's just that's just how I think you know again it's all logic you know you have to you have to make sure everything you do is a smart move you don't make a dumb decision because a dumb decision leads to fucking chaos chaos leads to fucking stress stress me you the world don't fucking need we don't need that we have enough problems in the world as it is we don't need to add more to this shit because you know that's how motherfuckers go crazy that's how motherfuckers be like oh shit man uh I gotta kill myself. Oh man, oh, I gotta dump. I gotta, I gotta, I can't, I can't leave this person. Uh, you know, and then as much as that shit happens on a, you know, an occurrence daily basis, at least around my surroundings, that's just, that's just how it is. So, with that being said, I'm out of here. Peace.